hi welcome back in this video I will discuss what is state space search in artificial intelligence and how to represent a problem using state space search in artificial intelligence so first we will try to understand what are the elements of uh, state space search in artificial intelligence state space search consists of uh, mainly two elements the first one is a set of uh, states possibly the number of states are infinite in artificial intelligence out of the possible uh, states one state represents the start state that is the initial state of the problem each state represent some configuration so that uh, it is reachable from the start state that is uh, uh, each and every state in the given set of states are reachable from the uh, start state out of the possible states some states may be the goal states that is nothing but the solution for a given problem the second element is a set of rules after applying a rule to the current state the current state will be transformed to another or you can say that the new state in the state space these rules may not be applicable to all states some rules are applicable to some states some rules are applicable to other states in this case now we will take a very simple example to understand how can we represent that problem using state space search in artificial intelligence so first example is the maze problem the maze problem can be represented as a state space uh, in this case a set of states are like uh, each state represents where you are that is the current position in the maze the start state or initial state represent the starting position in this case you can see s is the starting position the goal state represents the exit from maze in this case d is the exit uh, state or you can say that the goal state in this case so the task is to go from start state to this particular goal state here to go from start state to uh, goal state we need some uh, set of uh, uh, rules so the set of rules in this case are move north move south move east move west so these are the following uh, rules we can apply so that we can go from start state to we can say that the goal state here but one thing we need to remember is uh, each of these rules may not be applicable to all the states for example when uh, we are present at this particular position we can apply only move south here we cannot apply move east move west move south are not applicable when we are present at this particular state move east is applicable move south is applicable move north is applicable but move west is not applicable so for a given state some of these particular rules are applicable some of them are not applicable here so in this case we have represented this maze problem in the form of uh, state space now uh, we will take one more example that is uh, 15 fuzzle problem again uh, this can be represented in a st state space uh, first we need to have some uh, set of states here the start state is uh, some random configuration of uh, tiles i think you can see here this is a random configuration of tiles this is the first uh, or you can say that the start state the goal state it will be given to you in this case uh, the goal state is as shown over here now if you want to go from this particular start state to goal state uh, we have to do some what you can say that uh, uh, we have to apply some rules you can say uh, like uh, we have to move this particular empty space from uh, current position to up left right down or so on so the set of uh, possible rules are uh, move the empty space up move the empty space down move the empty, empty space uh, right or move the empty space left here so we have to move this particular thing right left up down so that we can reach this particular goal state in this case again uh, these particular uh, uh, rules may not be applicable for each state uh, at this particular uh, case or you can say that at this particular uh, state all particular four uh, rules are applicable but uh, when this particular empty space is present at uh, this position uh, all four rules are not applicable up is applicable right is applicable down is applicable but left is not applicable here so that is the one more thing we need to remember uh, when and uh, when 
a particular rule is applicable when it is not applicable now coming back to the last step uh, what is the general process to be followed uh, in solving a problem using state space search first step is to select uh, some way so that we can represent the problem in a state space in an unambiguous way that is the first thing in the previous uh, two examples we have represented maze and uh, 15 percent problem in a different uh, set of states so that is the first step we have to follow the second step is to follow all possible actions or operators so that uh, we can move from one state to other state all these actions or operators are called as the production rules once you represent the problem uh, in the form of state space and identified all the rules that is nothing but the production rules we need to represent the problem's uh, initial state and then we need to formulate precisely when the state satisfies the goal of our problem after this we need to activate the production rules that is nothing but we need to apply the production rules one at a time uh, to the initial state and its descendants so that we can reach the goal state once you reach the goal state the problem is solved in this case so if you want to solve a problem using the state space search in artificial intelligence first we need to represent the problem in the form of states in an unambiguous way we need to formulate all the production rules we need to represent the initial state or the uh, current state of the problem formulate precisely when the state satisfies the goal of the problem finally we need to activate the production rules so that we can reach the goal state from the initial or the current state so in this video i have explained what is uh, state space search what are the elements of uh, state space search how to represent the problem in the form of uh, state space search in artificial intelligence and what is the general process to be followed so that we can solve the given problem using state space search i hope the concept is clear if you like the video do like and uh, share with your friends press the subscribe button for more videos press the bell icon for regular updates thank you for watching